All right, so I got this thing out and it was exactly as I had hoped. Um, everything is identical on the drive as the, as the, uh, as well as the uh, passenger or whatever, the, the non-drive side. The only difference is this long post here, which is the drive side versus the other side. Just as a short one, but all of the other components are identical. Um, as I look at these lengths, the uh, pin sets. So there shouldn't be any problem if anybody wants to convert one of these passenger sides to a drive side. Um, it's just a matter of buying the kit. I think the kit was about 30 bucks on eBay. Um, and then you open up the, the passenger side. It's got the short, the short guy here versus the drive side has the long guy. So you'll want to replace that with that. And that is in the kit. Uh, so you could save yourself about a hundred bucks from buying this main unit if you wanted to. Uh, it did come out fairly easily. I had to pull it. If it was in there like that, I had to, I had to articulate it. I'm trying to get the angle right. <laughs> uh, this way, let's see here. Not that way. God, this is weird with the phone. This way, it had to come, <laughs> it had to come that way. Try to get it right, it had to come that way and so it came out. Um, not too bad, uh, once I cut the other bolt out, I uh, got the angle right, came out uh, going up, not down, came up and, and out and it uh, wasn't really too bad. So I'm gonna put the, uh, the new one in. Um, should be pretty easy actually. Yeah, this, is, this, is, this is turning out to be a fairly easy project, knock on wood. Uh, and then there's just two bolts, and then it's just a matter of putting the head assembly and electrical together, and uh, we got ourselves uh, a dual drive. Keep you posted.